And we are here at SeaWorld Orlando. Today is currently opening day after the COVID-19 pandemic shutdown of the park. And um, I'm currently looking at uh, my Spreaker. And um, that was a lightning strike that I just saw over here. Um, yeah, uh, I think I might uh, get a little, little closer, kind of take cover. Um, but while I'm uh, under these trees, I'm gonna kind of zoom in a little bit. Um, look at that top hat right there, it's looking really great. Um, nice uh, focus, there we go. Yeah, it's a good looking ride right there, but um, as I pan out, you kind of see uh, some of the weather. Uh, it's kind of hard to see that. Uh, but yeah. So as we kind of continue through in uh, our quick tour, of the new icebreaker coaster that will open at some point in the future. Um, now, even as we walk around, uh, there's some lightning in the area, so you might hear some thunder. Uh, I'm not sure how safe I feel by this spike right here, but there is the vertical spike for the coaster. We'll get more on that in a little bit. Uh, as you can see, this is a, a good looking ride. <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> All right, so that's about it for SeaWorld. So apparently there's a big time thunderstorm way over there and uh, they've shut down the rides. But yeah, this is Mako, it looks amazing. Uh, or not Mako, this is Manta. It looks amazing and uh, see it has a 25 minute wait and I love to get on this. So um, I think I'm gonna call it a day for the video. I'm glad that you guys got the chance to see the uh, icebreaker construction update. Um, they still have a lot to do. Uh, I expect it to be ready uh, after about a month and a half of construction effort and maybe another month of testing. So if they, they I didn't see any construction workers on site, but as soon as they resume, um, it'll it'll be about two and a half months and then we'll be getting on that ride. Uh, also with Iron Gwazi, I know we didn't cover that today, but that should be opening up at about the same time as, as uh, Icebreaker. So possibly late July, early August. And we'll get rides on that. And so that's uh, kind of more of an optimistic prediction. But hey, we'll go for it. Uh, late July, early August for uh, some rides on Iron Gwazi and Icebreaker. Thanks. Peace.